Hello, this is Joe Reagan. In this video, I would like to cover some basic finite element analysis with SOLIDWORKS. Here's a model I've created. It's a rough representation of a C-clamp. Since this C-clamp will be loaded symmetrically, I have cut half the model away and I will fully constrain this mid-plane. So let's create a study. I'll go to the simulation tab, create study on a static study. The first thing I want to do is I want to apply some mesh control because I know the stress will concentrate in this bend. So I'm going to set that mesh to a smaller size. You can of course type in a number representing the smallest mesh size. And I'm going to blend it out fairly slowly. I'll set A over B to 1.25. Check. I want to see how that mesh looks so I'll go ahead and create the mesh. Check. So that mesh has a, a lot of elements in it. It took this machine a few seconds to create and you can zoom in and see how it created this mesh finer which will yield more accurate, result, more accurate results. Okay, now I can I will move on and fix the correct geometry. So first I'll create fixed geometry. I want to fix this face check and then I want to add a load up here and I'll add a 50 pound force load or let's make it 100 100 pounds to that face check okay now let's run the model okay so the von Mises stress is in that plot the Y displacement would be given here you see there's minimal Y displacement a safety factor plot here we can change the maximum range you see you have this really high safety factor up in the low stress regions so let's edit our chart options and set that to I don't know 3 to 35 and you get a more telling plot with that new scale I hope this helps you explore finite element analysis in SOLIDWORKS thank you goodbye